but I, I've seen you involved in transactions where where you have refinanced a person's home, uh, their second home, uh, two or three of their investment properties, and, and created a lot of credit or helped them get some working capital for the business all at the same time. Right, that too. And, you know, we made the progression all the way down to their children. You know, so I've done generations of, you know, fathers and mothers and daughters and sons and so forth. So, which is kind of a rewarding experience for here. It's custom to watch that grow as well. Well, I know that's how you uh, started to develop this expertise in the reverse mortgage business because yes. many of your existing customers mm -hmm. would come to you and if they had refinanced their home and they'd say, you know, Larry, uh, I've, I've got a mom, I've got parents uh, that are in their, in their 70s, they're in their mid to late 60s, in their 70s, right. they're a little, maybe a little cash tight right now. Sure. Is it, it, can you help them? And, and, and you developing this expertise in the reverse mortgage business, you know, it's something that does require a tremendous amount of expertise no uh, and credibility and trust. You know, and you, yeah. Because you've established such trust and credibility with your mm -hmm. clients, they're coming to you and saying, Larry, please take care of my mom, take care of my dad, take care of my parents, right? Right, absolutely. And I, I think what we're the most pleased about, Jones, we've been cutting the cost of reverse mortgage about in half right now. Well, for so people who aren't familiar with reverse mortgages, Larry, let's describe what a re re reverse mortgage is, because some people may not be fully aware of what it is, and we'll get into the, the cost and how easily you make the process. Okay. Yeah. Reverse mortgage is really a simple process, John, quite honestly. It's all based on your home's value mm -hmm. and your age. Okay. And it's a very simple formula that, you know, they take the age and the value in the system. Well, every loan will be identical, that everybody will receive the same breakdown that FHA, which is the yeah. government-sponsored entity, is going to give them. So it allows seniors to use the equity in their home but not have any monthly payments for as wow. long as they live there as their primary residence. It almost sounds to me like you use your home... Like almost like a bank account, where if if, yeah. if it's say two hundred thousand dollars or a hundred thousand dollars of equity in the home, right. and you're seventy years old, mm -hmm. we do it. You do an analysis, and you say based on your age and the equity, uh, you can have this amount of money, and you don't have to make any payments on that. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Wow. And you know, one quick thing too: a lot of seniors ask me, "Well, when is somebody going to take my home?" Yeah. Nobody's going to ever take you home, right. okay? Yeah. That's the last thing anybody ever wants to happen, and particularly the government wants a senior to be out of a home. Right. So, But what we have done as well is we've aligned ourselves with attorneys such as people like yourself mm -hmm. who have used the home equity line for estate planning. Right. You know, so, you know, it may help the estate grow, not drain it. It's helping it grow and help them to provide for long-term health care, yeah. which is very important for seniors and very expensive. But they want to stay in their homes but they're going to need some assistance. Right. Using the equity line and taking care of some of the programs that are available and the insurance programs that are available, they can stay there, have their health care, have the funds to you know, manage mm -hmm. the home, and also take a portion and let it grow and grow the estate. 